we have to deal with mixed flows, as we have seen um, over the last three, four years in Europe, um, across the Mediterranean. So asylum seekers and what we call economic migrants. Um, I think it's very important to have a clear distinction of these different categories because uh, they are corresponding to different legal statuses. And I think um, given the sensitivity um, of the public opinion in Europe, uh, what people need is a sort of clarity of concepts and categories. If you explain that everything is, a, is, a, is the same thing, then the, the, the risk you run is that people will confuse everything and will reject everything. And I think it's very important to be clear about what, what we are talking about. That is legal mobility, legal migrants, uh, asylum seekers and, and, and refugees, and irregular migrants. So I think if we want to preserve legal mobility, if we want to preserve the uh, uh, right to asylum, then you have to fight against irregular migrants and the phenomenon that are linked to that. Otherwise, um, the, uh, the people won't uh, understand and will react in a very emotional and irrational way. So I think it's the government's responsibility to um, have a, a clear vision of what we should do. Um, and um, I know the, there are diver diverging interests, but we have to have a, a set of clear criteria and principles and also international norms.